Tegan, what drew you to the story of uh, True Spirit? Oh, I mean, it's such a huge story, particularly in Australian culture. I mean, every little girl knows Jess and, <laughs> and yeah, I watched that too. <laughs> I don't know. And I just, I mean, obviously great role, great script. And um, yeah, it was just a fun project. I'm so glad that I was drawn to it. Awesome. And Jessica, what was it like to kind of revisit that time of your life when it was being recreated in front of you while making the movie? Oh, it's so strange. You have no idea how weird it was. I think it really hit home when I came to the studios in pre-production and there were walls and walls of rooms covered in like inspiration mm. of my life. And I'm like, this is a bit weird and <laughs> almost a little bit creepy. Like, I no, totally just pictures upon pictures yeah. of Jessica just like, <laughs> like lying the walls. Mood boards. Yeah, of, like, seriously. Family life mood board. Yeah. You know, like bedroom mood board. <laughs> That's a bit weird, right? <laughs> that would be something and and tegan you know how much did you learn about managing and helming a boat you know during oh. the creation of the movie and what was that like well i had gone from literally zero sailing experience to having to you know when we film on the on the coast and on the water obviously i can't have someone else sailing for me because it's my face and so i was able to shakily you know helm the boat skipper this little little um little pink lady and uh god i had such a great time I, I i was really shocked by how fun i found sailing and how you know engrossing it really can get and just enjoying you know the wind and the waves but then also i really enjoy the precision of sailing it's all about you know getting the um optimum is that the right angle word? yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly <laughs> yeah yeah because you've got this incredible math brain so you kind of brought that to it which yeah. is cool but i think it shines through that you were enjoying it I think so. I hope so. It really was. Having a good time. Yeah, no, I think it definitely shows. <laughs> <laughs> and Jessica, you know, what did your family and, and instructor and everyone think of all the actors and actresses chosen to portray them? Yeah, I mean, you know, I think it's so weird for them, right? It's it's incredibly weird. And I they're they're thrilled. I think they're happy. Um, um the the character Ben is actually an amalgamation of a number of people. Um, which is amazing. Um, but yeah, I mean, that relationship is is really one of my favorite things in the movie yeah, as well. Yeah, same. Yeah. Definitely. And, you know, Tegan, how did the two of you work together to make this film's version of, of Jessica, you know, so authentic and, and so oh, true, thank I assume? You. <laughs> Truly spiritual. Uh, thank you. I guess we just chatted and with Sarah early on, we had dinner and we just talked about how we wanted to create a character from the ground up, not just a mimic of Jess. And so, you know, putting some of myself into that, I was really lucky to, lucky that it was COVID and we didn't see my family. So I had this kind of similar emotional experience to Jess in that kind of time. So I was able to bring a level of authenticity that I wouldn't have been able to without lockdown and isolation. Yeah, I can't believe we're calling COVID lucky, I'm but like, yeah, in that, <laughs> to give you that experience, I suppose. Silver lining. 